guys there's a lot going on in nollywood right now now um actors are just dropping every day like flies first it was ceci Caudry, then we had mr ibu then amechi monago and now junior pope and to make matters worse our destiny tico seems to be on the line now it is sad news because um a prophet has just prophesied that this actress is actually next in line to be joining these um, actors i just mentioned now surprisingly this uh, this prophet his prophecy is so easy to believe because several months ago about eight months ago he actually prophesied uh, junior pope's uh, demise as well now he has come out to say that the actress is next in line <laughs> guys if you get this kind of news that there is no way you will not be scared no matter how uh, strong your faith is no matter how 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 grounded you think you are in the lord now the actress on her own part is not taking it lightly and i'm so happy for this fact now she on her part has now embarked on the seven days fasting program now most people might laugh at her and say ah, why is she doing this if she's scared of death but the fact remains that anyone would be scared of actually um going like that now she is saying that she why she's not scared she's just doing it to secure herself guys uh, as, you, as the prophecy goes if you reveal if you listen to it uh, you'll be really surprised now two different pastors on different different occasions have now come out to give this prophecy to her and as it goes somebody really close to her is will actually be the one to harm her via drink via food or whatever now she has to be more careful because you never can tell they say the enemy is within is always the one who we should be afraid of because if the enemy within doesn't give the enemy outside information there is no way they can harm you now friends around her will not be the one to harm her we don't know how true this is okay but we do know that at, at least one of the prophecies have come true so in a way it's actually a good thing that she has not decided to to embark on this fast okay guys personally me i think that it's always best to err on the side of caution and if you are religious you will know that there's nothing prayer cannot do you know her very simple prayer might just expose that one friend that is out to harm her or it could just make them so busy that <laughs> on that particular day they will get so many um distractions and so many problems that they forget her very existence so it's a good uh, move on her part and i seriously hope that she is uh, protected guys just take your time to listen to the video and let me know what um you think you know pope, pope yeah do you know pope to be one guy for the nigeria movie industry where they do very well mm -hmm. but i want to send a message to you for cross check a papa inside because the darkness on junior pope not take time out plus in family or oh, one day bad news go forth for nigeria they go regret because the gods from the father's side, you know, they make hot for it back. Mm. The gods from the father's side, they are throwing accident his way in the spiritual world. Well I beg, no vex, yeah? Yeah, bros. Yeah, yeah. The only thing they bought, no vex. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the love. The only thing they bought, no guys that's the prophecy about junior pope i just wish that when this prophecy came um he actually took it seriously and did something about it now the beautiful thing about prophecies is that they're actually more like a sneak peek into the future you know something that can foretell what can happen in the future and then with prayers with the right kind of prayers you can you can change things so i am so happy that um nollywood actress destiny tico has taken it upon herself to embark on a seven day uh, prayer and and fasting program now a lot of people might actually think that this is a joke but the actress knows what's up she knows that the spiritual world is a very powerful one and then she's not prophecies i know but for me prophecies are for redemption whatever it is that anyone be you a pastor be you a native man or whatever you are whatever you serve whatever you whenever you see anything about anybody and it's being said out it's for redemption God, um, God opens the eyes of people that sees to say it out for you to be redeemed. What is your name, ma'am? What is your figure, ma'am? Who watch Kukam? I'm a child of God. I'm a child of destiny. Nothing can ever happen to me. I'm a strong woman, and not just that. My 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 people are strong. My guardian angels are strong. The people who God, whom God sent after me to take care of me are strong. 
So nothing will happen to me. Onye kwe chie kwe. But the most important thing is that whatever it is that you serve. So guys, that's it. You, you've heard it from the horse's mouth. Prophecies are not really out, uh, out there to scale. They're actually for redemption. You know, it's more like God actually sends out these um, warnings through a man of God. And then we are to now pray to change things. Now, no matter how you, how, um, of a, how, how do I put it now, how soft your faith is, once you pray, uh, you know, God will actually now move to change things in your stead. Now, I'm really happy that the actress knows these things and she's not taking things lightly because of a true there have been too many um calamities in nollywood and really guys if you look at it you will know that this is not ordinary you no know? ex actors are just dropping left right and center and nobody's seeing anything nobody's doing anything now it now goes to show that um it's now all man for himself you you really have to be up and fight for yourself keep yourself safe now when you now come to the fact that you have actually now been singled out like the actress has now been told that she is the next to go i am so glad that she's not just sitting down there waiting you know just uh, trying to like um downplay the whole thing and just take it lightly she's doing what she's supposed to do and that is so good guys let's join hands in, in praying for the actress let's hope let's pray that she will be safe that no evil will, will come her way that every friend that is out there to uh, truncate her destiny to cut <coughs> excuse me to cut short her life will be exposed and disgraced because truly truly nobody deserves death even the worst person doesn't deserve to uh be uh taken out like that let alone someone who is just out there doing her thing so let's keep this lady in our prayers you now let's hope that she is safe and then all will be well so that guys that's all we have for you today on the ongoing and junior pop destiny tico um saga guys we hope that you've gotten a thing or two from this video remember to keep destiny tico in your prayers and most importantly remember to subscribe to this channel so that you get fresh um entertainment um just fresh information about your favorite nollywood actress and actor guys please also give this video a thumbs up share with your friends as many as they are and i'll see you in the next video bye guys